Yeah. Yeah, whatever wastes you want. Oh, wastes. Cameron, do you think? Waiting. I think I can hold that shit. End times danger. Defense. Wait till defense, there you go. Friday. I'm oh, waiting defects, right? Jacob, some of the defects. Um uh, when I do the injection uh uh Accurate. Yeah, over mold sometimes. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Chris, example of waiting. Well, at the moment I'm waiting for lockers, but it's not really. I suppose it's not really too relevant in here. In terms of our production, I think it's just like you guys generally waiting for parts and stuff for the machine. So it's trying to make a. I was, I was saying this morning to Jake, I'm trying to make a change so that we. Um, so I'm running the machine like, I said I would do it anyway eventually, but I started running the machine really early this morning. Um, and it would be good to have a split shift slightly, like over lunch, and it runs over lunch time because at the moment it's our bottleneck. Obviously once we get a second machine, it probably won't be our bottleneck anymore, we have to do that. But. Okay. Um, new problems? Not necessarily new, but I noticed that um, just start, it's like set up times on, on the lay sometimes it's just like really long if you have to like change out over to it you just try to work out how you make it quicker like what is it that we do to just like make it easier oh, excuse me <laughs> any, uh, any ideas to solve Chris's issue? I think maybe really isn't there high uh, you always got to go through changing the tools and the... Yeah. I mean, generally speaking, I think... I mean, obviously, if we could get, if we could get a tool probe on the actual machine, so that would be really great, really calm. Um, so... I mean, a lot of the... In changing out a lot of the inserts is... You know, like, make, uh, like normally doesn't, doesn't do too much in terms of uh, causing too many issues, but... Um, yeah, it's just I think it's just like positioning and stuff and just making sure it's successful. So maybe like so someone said before about having uh, I think it was Phil or Andrew, I can't remember, said about having a tray of parts ready before the changeover. So on your last while you're machining your last part of whatever material you were doing beforehand, you already set out all of the stuff that you need to do your changeover during that time. Therefore you're like not you know, not wasting the time, you've got less downtime. Okay. Uh, anyone else got, got any problems, Jacob? Everything. None I can think of really at the moment. No. Can we? No. No. Uh, no new problems, but I fixed here. Yeah. I can find something in the cupboard problem, but I labeled it. Yeah. 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 I haven't got one in the microwave, so I just, just, just for on that subject, I just want to also say I liked that Jacob yesterday did a fix what bugged him. And it was like literally, apparently, you guys kept asking what the address was. Yes. So All the time. I'm, right, right, I've said the address I'm not telling you anymore. That's on the wall. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, how's free yes going, guys? Cameron, how is free yes going? <laughs> yeah, right, it's good, man. How much free yes did you just a little bit, <laughs> not as much as I should have. Okay. Three seconds. Because <laughs> remember, you've got, you remember, you're not just, just it's not just shine, it's the sort of standard. Just, just, just like putting things in order and putting it in its place and labeling it and making sure everyone knows that's where it goes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I did a lot of that last night as well, didn't I? Um, yeah. Yeah, something you sorted out the boxes yeah, and stuff yeah, on the wall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, to label, that's the next. Step. Yeah. No. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'll go for it. Uh, yeah, it's going alright. It's just more of the fact we're on the resin floor where we just put the new shelves like maybe 
one more and then we had to go through and actually sort them out. I know last time we were just putting them onto a clear space. Then we sort out what's on each other. So yeah. I freeze going for you, Chris. Um, I didn't freeze this one. Oh dear. Oh, no. But I, 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 I needed to, so again, so just consistent audio, but I needed to keep the light coming. I know that that's like literally the thing that's holding everyone else up. So I made that my like, main priority. I don't, and again, I don't know whether or not. Uh, you know, generally, when Jamie and Max are back, we kind of got the numbers to still free S and just free one person to just get on yeah. the machine. It's not really a massive, massive issue. Um, when is it? Yeah, Wednesday when Mike's back, yeah. Jamie's on Monday, so yeah, he's on Monday. Right, health and safety, any issues? Uh, did you bring your safety call with you? Uh, I can find them up in Austin. Okay, I think it's morning. Liam needs some for like late operations, maybe for like maybe a little bit more open. Okay, well, that's um, Jake, on safety. Um, I can't think of anything to add to health and safety or any issues that I've got, or, like I've seen some problems. But. Okay. Uh, Cammy. Mm -hmm. Right. So mm -hmm. that's a bit of safety. Uh, plan of the day. Mm -hmm. with you, Chris. Uh, so I'm gonna get uh, Liam to get the. We're gonna get the machine up to stainless steel and start doing some of the stainless steel stuff so we can at least get on the path markers because I think there's 21. So. Yeah. yeah. Peter's all done, so that's quite a big section of that all done. I think you guys already got the spotlights pretty much done, haven't you? Yeah, pretty sure. Yeah. Yeah. We need to do the water feature light. Water feature light, yeah. which you've, you've seen we've got the hinges and yeah. the, uh, I've just done the plates, but they obviously need to be sanded and stuff, yeah. Um, uh, yeah, I mean, generally, generally just kind of keeping that bit running, I think. Okay, uh, Liam? Uh, again, on that day, and I'm still getting it. I'm going to do sand in the country for what it runs in that. Good man. Uh, can we? Make sure the whisker stuff is running correctly, and then uh, do pieces and our display case. Try to get as much done. Yeah. Jacob? I've uh, got these some LED protection circuits and also make up some cable for you. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it's good, right. Uh, all right, I don't forget to protect the QBR and have a good day. All right. Yeah.